Hey guys, welcome back to another quick and easy beginner friendly tutorial. And today I'm going to show you how to use the new Leonardo AI generator. So the age of these new AI generative programs is upon us. Things like ChatGPT, OpenAI, Midjourney, and now Leonardo AI. So first things first, we need to make an Leonardo AI account. Same way we also have an account for ChatGPT or Midjourney. Making a Leonardo AI account is free. The only thing we need to do is to get instant access is to whitelist ourselves. So on the whitelist screen, you need to apply to be on the early access list. Just fill in the details with your first name, a valid email address, and then click count me in. It may take some time before Leonardo AI gets back to you, but once they do, just go ahead and click on the link as shown here. Then fill out the necessary details, and there you go. You now are whitelisted for the Leonardo AI program. Now you can really begin the account creation process and log in. Here you can see the Leonardo AI dashboard, including the home button, a community feed, personal feed, training datasets, and the fine-tuned models. So let's begin, and underneath the user tools on the left-hand side, go ahead and click on AI image generation. Here, Leonardo AI will give you a quick rundown of the capabilities of this AI generation tool. As you can see, there are a huge number of different options to edit the AI-generated images you'll be getting from Leonardo AI. Before we continue though, let's go back to the main dashboard and let's check out the settings available for Leonardo AI. From the settings list, you can see your username, the user API, and you can even personalize your Leonardo profile by choosing your interests. Now on the lower left corner, you can click on the icon of Discord. By clicking this icon, you'll be invited to join the Leonardo.ai Discord group. Just accept the invite, and it'll bring you through a quick setup process to get you situated in the Discord server for Leonardo AI. Here, you can choose your language settings, set up notifications, and that's really all there is to it in order to join the Leonardo AI Discord server. Make sure to thoroughly read the rules and server regulations. And once you're done, click on finish and ta-da, you're now part of the Leonardo AI Discord server. As you can see, this is a quickly growing community full of different people all enjoying the use of AI generated images. There are different chat servers, different programs and guides and tutorials and even a beginner's guide to get you situated with using Leonardo AI. So for now, let's go back to the Leonardo AI website, and let's explore the other menus available to us. On the left-hand side, pick Community Feed, and here you can see all the AI-generated images made by the community members of Leonardo AI. Go ahead and click on any image, and here you can see which user generated this image, the prompts that they use, and all the details regarding the image, like resolution, date of creation, resonance, etc. As you can see, there are so many different community members all contributing with the AI generation image community. As you can see, there are so many creative prompts that people use in order to make such beautiful AI-generated images. On the left-hand side, you can also view your personal feed. This is where you'll be able to see all the generated images you've made using your account and all the prompts that you use. For the tech savvy out there, Leonardo AI also allows you to make your own custom model and datasets. Moving on to the fine-tuned models list, here you can see all the custom made models that people have worked tirelessly on to really nail down a certain style or look. As you can see, you can even see a list of your own models and favorite certain community models or platform models for use anytime. Now let's go back to the AI generation tool 
And as you can see, there are really so many options that you can use when generating your AI images. What's a really cool feature is also the AI canvas that Leonardo AI has. By using the AI canvas, you can either upload your own image or take a generated image and really fine tune certain details and modify certain styles. The AI canvas editor for Leonardo AI is truly quite robust and deserves a video of its own. Another neat feature that is only present in Leonardo AI is its texture generation. So for those of you who are aspiring 3D modelers, you can even use Leonardo AI to generate textures for your models. Now let's go back to the AI generation tool and let's start generating our first model. As you can see, in the AI generation tool, you have the option to choose a fine-tuned model, the style of the model, and even add negative prompts in order to fine-tune the prompts that you're using. Remember, you could take your time to view all these settings until you're happy with the settings that you've chosen. For now, let's make our first prompt and let's choose a simple close-up picture of a beautiful woman in the forest and let's make it photorealistic. Just give Leonardo AI a few moments and there you go, we now have a custom generated image of our prompt. Even after generating your image, Leonardo AI also offers certain options to customize your image further. These options include unzooming the image, removing the background, and using creative upscaling. All of these features require Leonardo tokens. These tokens will refresh after a certain amount of time, but remember, you only have a finite number of them per day. Once you're happy with the generated image, feel free to close the editor and save your image. And there you go. You now have a really basic understanding of how to use Leonardo AI in order to generate your own custom images. If you have any other questions, feel free to use the Leonardo AI Discord or comment down below and we'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy this kind of content, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, and happy AI generating!